Well, good afternoon. I'm uh, deeply annoyed because I just recorded this video and then deleted it by mistake. Ha ha, wonderful. Uh, that said, uh, we're back. Uh, or You never knew that I was gone. So, welcome uh, to everyone. This is a public post explaining what's going to happen um, in the near future. Uh, so, if you're a Patreon, this applies to you. If you're not a Patreon, you're seeing it for the first time, uh, welcome aboard. I'm Tony the Poet. Uh, who uh, runs this Patreon and uh, tries to uh, use it often. Uh, over the last year or so, Patreon has been pushing out a number of changes to its structure. Many of them have been invisible to the users, um, fit more into the back end and how we administer things. Lately, they have been pushing out more user features. So in, in no particular order, what we've seen over the last several months is, number one, the offering of trial memberships where people can get on a particular level, uh, in my case it's the $10 level, look at the content and decide if they want to pay the $10 a month to continue. Still there. They have pushed out what are called collections where I can actually group products on the Patreon and folks in the Patreon universe, doesn't have to be my Patreon specific, my site specifically, but any Patreon site can um, go on, look at my collections, and perhaps download or purchase some of the stuff that I have put out for my patrons in the past. Uh, and that's available on my site under the tab Collections. Lately, they also have been pushing something called The Marketplace, which allows me to put merchandise for sale out that would be available to anybody. So I can direct people to my Patreon to purchase merchandise. I may yet put my most recent album out there. For you folks, it's still available as a download for free. Patreon folks. <clears throat> the most recent thing that was just rolled out over the last week or so is they are now allowing for free memberships. People who would see your public posts would have a greater degree of involvement in terms of being able to message and talk to me directly versus the way Pat, in the way that Pat, patrons have always done, uh, but they would actually be considered members of the site at the free level. Uh, I have mixed feelings about this. I think in some cases people will stay free to avoid, you know, paying uh, and getting involved in stuff. Um, on the other hand, I also see it as a gateway to entering the Patreon universe of my of Tony with Dark Matter. Um, so what I'm going to be doing over the next week or so, uh, and I don't have it completely cleared out yet because I have to look at what the rewards are, is I'm going to set up uh, tiers that are more clearly evenly spaced between what's already there. Um, so the free group will get a couple of public posts a month, probably a poem and something else, a discussion of poetry or discussion of art or whatever. Um, the dollar folks will probably get access to those public posts. Of course, everyone gets access to the public posts. Uh, get access to those and something else, probably the Sunday exclusive poems. Um, the $5 folks, folks at the $5 tier will get the, the Sunday exclusive poems and access to the quarterly ebooks as they come out. Um, and I, I have to figure out where to put the yearly anthology. I think that'll probably also be a paid members perk. And so on and so on and so on. The $10 will continue to keep the trial membership. Uh, 15 and 25 I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing there. $10, I think I've already said that I'm going to let you folks have free access to my public workshops. Uh, and, uh, you know, all you have to do is let me know and I'll give a send you the Zoom link. So what I'm looking to do is I'm looking to create a broader spacing between the tiers so it's very clear what the value is of being a $5 member, a $10 menu. I'm not 100% sure that that's there right now. And it may require shifting the tiers a little bit, but I don't think so. I think I'm going to keep them where they are. Um, again, I'm not entirely sure the logistics, so I don't want to be 100% solid in this video post as to what it's going to look like, but that is absolutely the plan. Um, and I'm hoping that it keeps people interested in being a paying member of the site, uh, as well as keeping perhaps some of the folks who I know have dropped out because of economic hardship, having at least a link to that, uh, a link to what I've been doing here. I am not so egotistical that I think that people are going to be flocking here to, uh, to join up just because they now have a paid membership and they want to get more. 
But maybe. We don't know. I had actually toyed with the idea of canceling my Patreon. Uh, I have a new job. Uh, it's a decent salary. Uh, it has relieved and continues to relieve some of the deep financial pressure I was on, uh, which for a while, this was pretty much my only reliable source of income. And it's not huge, but it's enough to sort of get me through. I'm going to keep it um, for the time being. I don't see any reason to get rid of it. Uh, at this point. Uh, I think I do offer good stuff, and I hope you feel the same. Um, I've also just started taking my pension. Talk about something that makes you feel old. Say, yes, my pension will be coming in. And I've taken this new job. So the monetary aspect of Patreon has become less critical. Um, it's more about wanting to do something that replaces feature performances that I used to do all the time that I'm not doing as much anymore. I want to do something that replaces band gigs that I'm not doing anymore. So keep your eyes open. There will be more information this week about what the actual rewards will look like. I'm going to simplify them, amplify them, and make a little clearer picture of what it all looks like. Um, and I hope you find it valuable. And I hope you decide to stay and uh, if you find that this makes it easier for you to become a free membership uh, for your own life, I'd rather have you here like that uh, than, than, than feel that you vanished completely. Um, there'll be more, I promise. Uh, I'm going to try and not delete this video. <laughs> so if you're seeing it, I didn't. And uh, I look forward to speaking with you all. Please pass on your comments, your thoughts about process, thoughts about what I'm going, what I'm doing next, as they do. I would love to have more engagement from my members, and that's another thing that I'm thinking the free membership might do. Okay, that's it. I gotta lock this up. Got other stuff I gotta do. Uh, gotta start growing my hair back. I'll see you. Bye. Onward.